Hello. Today's devotional comes from Jesus' words in John 15, 5, where he said, I am the vine and you are the branches. He who abides in me and I in him bears much fruit, for apart from me you can do nothing. We looked at Psalm 92 as a motivation for our quiet times with God. And Jesus' words here in John 15, 5 are also an encouragement to abide in the Lord and remain in him. Apart from me, you can do nothing. Those are sobering words. It reminds us that we can exist or be spiritually productive apart from an ongoing relationship with the Lord Jesus Christ. So what does a quiet time look like? I think that it uh, means setting apart a specific duration to uh, be with our Bibles and to read a chapter. The Billy Graham Association says that the best place to start reading the Bible is the Gospel of John. Uh, also, other places where uh, they lend themselves to uh, readership um, in an easier way might be the book of Genesis or the book of Proverbs. I had a pastor friend tell me one time to spend much time in the red and to pray for the power. In other words, spending a lot of time in the red part of your New Testament, which are, of course, the words of Jesus and the Gospels. But Paul preached that we should proclaim the whole counsel of God, and so every bit of Scripture is inspired by him and is anointed by the Spirit of uh, and spoken by the Spirit, and so we should always spend our time reading through the Bible. But there are places to begin, like the Gospel of John, like the book of Proverbs, like the book of Genesis. And so when Jesus said, apart from me, you can do nothing, it implies that we need to spend time reading our scriptures, also spending time in prayer. Now, prayer can be summed up uh, with a great outline found in the Lord's Prayer. Also, someone summarized even the Lord's Prayer in the acrostic ACTS, Acts, meaning that a proper prayer time should include times of adoration, where we extol the Lord and praise Him for His character and His goodness. Should also spend time confessing our sins. Confession is good for the soul. T stands for thanksgiving, that we ought to thank God for his rich mercies, his blessings every day. And then, of course, supplication means depending on God for our daily bread and asking him to fulfill our needs. So when Jesus said, apart from me, you can do nothing, abiding in him means that we ought to spend time in quiet meditation before the Lord. May God bless your day.